Hey y'all, it's your girl Kenda coming back at you with another video. So today I'm going to tell you 10 things that you can use your breast milk for. So if you're like me and you're not breastfeeding and you have leftover breast milk, then these are some things that you can use it for. And I just made a little list here. So I got my little notes, my little cheat sheet. Um, so breast milk is referred to as liquid gold. And the reason being is because it's so good for you. It's so good for your baby. Um, you can use it on yourself if you have any type of skin issues. You can use it as a topical ointment. And I'm just going to go through some of the uses. I'm pretty sure there's probably way more. But I'm just going to go through a few of them. And, you know, if you guys know anything that I'm not mentioning, then definitely leave it in the comments below. Um... And just let me know what maybe you might be using your extra breast milk for. All right. So there we go. So first things first. Um, if your kid has conjunctivitis, you can put a drop of your breast milk in the dropper and just drop it in their eye. And it will help to clear, clear that out. Secondly... Acne, 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 acne. If I literally just finished my friend. I don't know why we call it a friend because there ain't nothing friendly about your men menstrual cycle. I don't know who came up with the term friend because she's not nice. <laughs> okay, And I don't need no friend in my life who's not nice. And she's not nice. Okay. So yeah, I just got over my little friends. And so she left her little, you know, her little things, but I'm gonna get rid of her. Don't worry about it. It's gonna go. We're gonna get rid of it ASAP. Um, so yeah, if you have acne or if the baby has acne, um, you can use it on your acne and it will help to clear up your acne. Um, ear infections. Now this one I've tried and it actually worked. This was recently, maybe about a month or two ago. My son had an ear infection and someone at work told me about it. And I was like, oh, he has an ear infection. She was like, oh, do you have leftover breast milk? Just put some in his ear. And I was like, okay, let me try it. And I did it and he was fine. And the night before he was like crying, 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 crying. And he was fine. I didn't even, like I took him to the doctors. They didn't even see nothing in his ear, nothing. So it was like instant. I was just so happy for that. I did it twice that day. It was like a Sunday. I did it twice that Sunday, like in the morning and then later on in the day. And then um, in the Monday and the next morning, I took him and he was fine. So that um, for sure works. <laughs> um, treating diaper rash. So just like your acne, you know, I really feel like it's good for skin issues. I even seen Kim Kardashian stealing... Um, not Chloe. What's the other one's name? Oh my God, I'm having a brain fart. I haven't watched them in forever. So it's Chloe, it's Kim, Courtney. There we go. <laughs> ah, mom life, mom life. So, um, yeah, Kim Kardashian was stealing Courtney's breast milk for her psoriasis. So it's good for your skin as well. Um, healing sore or cracked nipples. Now, for those of you who are not moms yet, or maybe you're a mom and you didn't breastfeed, you don't have this problem. But for those of you who are breastfeeding, those sore nipples are serious. I never had like crazy cracked nipples, but I had sore nipples and I just, I sometimes I would literally like, I can't breastfeed him. Like I can't do it. So I this one I've done and it absolutely works. You literally just take the breast milk and you wrap it all around your nipple and you let it just sit there and dry and it works it absolutely works um making a lotion i haven't done this but it makes sense because most lotions are made out of some type of you know um dairy product uh even like goat's milk and things like that so that makes sense that you can make lotion out of it um making yogurt for your baby that's a good one Ace Pops. This one's a really good one, too, for, like, teething babies. You know, they're getting those teeth in, and it's not fun. It's not fun. <laughs> teething babies are not fun, okay? Sis, if you don't know, I'm here to tell you. Teething babies are not fun, okay? So, yeah, if they're teething, 
um, ice pops. Literally take some milk, put it in ice tray, put a little like popsicle. You can buy those popsicle sticks at the dollar store and just let them suck on it. You know, those really do help. Making cheese. I don't know if I want cheese breast milk, but maybe for the baby, you know, maybe, you know, I don't know. I won't be eating no cheese breast milk, but hey, and making soap. So that's my top 10. And then the bonus one, y'all know what the bonus one is, feeding the baby. Come on now. <laughs> so yes, that's my top 10 on the liquid gold. The top 10 things you can do with breast milk. If you guys know any other things you can do with breast milk, definitely leave it in the comments. Let me know. Um, you know, if there's anything that you've done with your breast milk or that you know of someone who's done with their breast milk that, you know, I don't know about. Maybe I need to try something new. Because I've used it on my skin to clear up acne. Um, if you didn't see my last video where I made a mask out of it with honey, you need to go back and watch that one. So I made a little face mask with it, um, with honey. I need to do it again, obviously, because I'm breaking out from my friends. <laughs> so yeah, if you guys know any anything or anything I didn't mention, definitely leave in the comments. And don't forget, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. All right, thank you for watching. See ya.